Johnny, we'd like to thank you again for coming to My Strange Addiction. Could you tell us again what your addiction is, please? Well, it's a little embarrassing to admit, but uh, yeah, I do order about 50 takeouts a day. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of embarrassing. <laughs> Well, lucky for you, Johnny, 50 is just a rookie number compared to our other contestant who actually orders over 500 takeouts a day. <laughs> yeah, get the fuck out of my studio. 500 takeouts a day? Who the... Emberlyn Raid, a YouTuber who started a weight loss journey like about 50 years ago before she was even born she started her weight loss journey and uh, so far with this weight loss journey she's gained about 100 pounds so you might as well just call this a reverse weight loss journey. A while ago our morbidly obese YouTuber Emberlyn was called out for shaming fat people. So a, a fat person was fat shaming fat people? That's like beating yourself up. We went into Texas Roadhouse today and when we went to go sit down there was this girl who, you know, to me looked like she was maybe like 50 pounds bigger than me. I can't really say I asked Destiny. Like I have this like crazy thing where if I see someone that's like really morbidly obese like I am, I'll literally ask whoever I'm with, hey, is that person bigger than me? I don't know why I do it. I don't know if it's because I want to feel better about myself or I want to understand how other people visually see me. I really don't know what it is. And I asked Destiny, she's like, I don't know, I wasn't really looking at her. I'm like, oh, that helps. She asked her girlfriend to see if she noticed the other fat girl asking her if she's fatter than her? It's so weird how she was like, she was probably around 50 pounds more than me. How did you even determine that? Like she took a scan of this poor woman's body and she's like, 20, 50, 60, um, um, we're about the same, but yeah, she's, she's definitely more obese than me. She's at least 50 pounds more, fat bitch. You're at a restaurant and you're there to have lunch or dinner with your girlfriend, but instead you're scanning other people's bodies? How fucked up is that? Me, she looked like she was about 50 pounds bigger than I was. Either way, we were both like super huge in the restaurant. And she was also okay. sitting at a table with her like chunky friend and the details I couldn't help but almost like judge this morbidly obese girl like i am morbidly obese and i'm worried about other people judging me but yet i am sitting there almost like judging this girl like almost i wouldn't say i was like judging her like oh my god this big girl's in a restaurant i was more so looking at her thinking i'm so sad for her like i'm sad that she's She's obese, and I noticed how other people stared at her. That's literally judging. What do you mean, um, I almost judged her? Couldn't help but almost like judge this morbidly obese girl. Like She's not trying to sound rude, but you started the story seeing how you were judging this woman and her friend for being fat. What the fuck does that mean, almost judging this girl while you're judging the fuck out of her? I'm so sad for her. Someone should give this girl a mirror. She was sad that this other girl was obese, but like, this other girl is literally right here. You're the other girl. How about you start feeling sad for yourself first and then worry about other people? I felt so bad for this disgusting, morbidly obese person. Like, bitch, do something about your weight. <laughs> Couldn't be me though. Anyways, can I order 20 cheeseburgers? Uh, yeah, five Big Macs, 32 large fries, light oil, please. Yeah, I'm not feeling like eating a lot of calories today. Yeah, light oil, lightly salted, not a lot of sodium, and 49 Diet Cokes. Yeah, we don't want those calories here. Unlike some... Yeah, that fat bitch over there. Oh my god, fat people. And then I really almost didn't even want to sit there because I felt like we were going to draw attention because it's two really big girls. Okay. And it's like... When the girl stood up to leave, I hadn't even gotten my food yet, and it's like... I couldn't stop staring at her. Like, all what I could think about fuck? was like, I'm so sad for her. Like, why is she eating out? I did think that at one point. Like, what? Like, I almost wanted to grab her and just be like, eat healthy, lose weight. I know the fat shaming that she's doing right now is so messed up, but what gets me more is that this was supposed to be at a restaurant. She was supposed to be having lunch with her girlfriend, but instead, she's focusing 
on judging someone for being fat. How are you worrying about this woman this entire time while you're over here sitting, eating out, doing the same thing as this woman? The irony of that! How are you so bothered by someone who's obese when that someone is you? That's so weird! Just kidding, okay. Oh, okay, so we're just gonna cut to her eating a big fat sandwich. Mm. Mm. I love sandwiches like this. We can tell. And the olives. I feel like if you like olives, don't get mayonnaise. The olives kind of give that like kick you need. Skinny hack, instead of getting mayonnaise, get a couple of olives because that's gonna reduce your 5,000 calorie sandwich from 5,000 to 4,990. So you're saving yourself 10 calories. I don't know if I want to eat this because I kind of want to balance it out and okay. I have already a meal prepped and healthy, ready to rumble, so. Okay, I see you. Maybe this is where the weight loss begins. So, I've eaten quite a bit already. <laughs> and I think- Immediately cuts to her eating what she just said that she's not gonna eat. I'm full, y'all. The broccoli is the best part. The broccoli? Where's the broccoli? Mm, this was good. Where the fuck is that broccoli? Is anyone seeing any... Hold up. Maybe I'm just not seeing this broccoli without my glasses. Hold up. No, still no broccoli. Maybe I'm not seeing this broccoli well because I don't have my loop. Hold up. I don't... I don't see any broccoli. Is the broccoli in the room with us? Broccoli was there in spirit. <laughs> broccoli called in sick today. <laughs> Just enjoy your noodles or whatever you're eating. You don't have to lie that you're having broccoli with it. You eating broccoli with your fried noodles doesn't make it a healthy meal. They gave me two chips, although I asked for an apple. Oh no! But that's okay. This is not a veggie sandwich. Wow. Oh, it's not? Turkey with bacon and Ew. cheese. I'm really, really upset right now. Yeah. Don't eat it. Return that shit. I'll try it. Oh. Here we go. Tasty. Bacon. Honey, that's not what I asked for. <laughs> she was so disappointed that they didn't give her an apple. Because that apple was supposed to make her lose weight after she ate 6,000 calories. She obviously asked for a veggie sandwich. And the people that work at Panera, they saw her and they're like, oh my god, she's so skinny. We can't give her a veggie sandwich. So they gave her a turkey and bacon sandwich. They obviously saw that this girl was starving. I understand them mistakenly giving her two chips instead of an apple, but them giving her a bacon and turkey sandwich instead of a veggie sandwich happens every single day, especially to poor Amby over here. Got oh my some god, she can barely walk. Take out. Oh, I forgot. It comes with like a huge salad. I didn't realize the salad was going to be that big. Oh my god, that ruined her day! It's like a vodka sauce with fettuccine. That fucking salad made her question her entire life. So I just got my takeout order, fried chicken as usual, and it... Oh, it comes with a sa... What's this green thing? What do they call it again? A salad? Sa sa salad. Wow, so this is a salad? So is this the thing that people eat to stay skinny? Why is it so colorful? Is this vegetarian? Where does the salad come from? Why is the salad not deep fried? Should I take a picture for Instagram? I ordered a thing of fries and I only ordered one, but for some but reason they gave me two. God damn it, they gave her two! Oh. I will not be eating this. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? What just happened? I ordered only one fry and they accidentally gave me two. What? How could they do that to me? Don't ever give me two fries again. I'm trying to lose weight here. Oh my god. It was an accident, guys. I swear to god. Anyways, let me just finish my lunch. Oh. <gasps> 
I will not be ordering this disgusting shit again. Look at how much food there's left in there. It's full. I barely touched this. Oh my god, this food was disgusting. Never ordering this shit again. Actually, I'm gonna leave a complaint. They're always messing up her order. First she orders a fry, then they give her two. Then she orders an apple and they give her two chips. And then she orders a veggie sandwich and they give her a turkey and bacon sandwich? God damn these fast food employees. They're always messing up her order. She actually ordered three fries, but they forgot one. I don't even like pizza. Pepperoni. I'm not really a pepperoni girl, but... Let me guess, she's gonna... Oh well. Okay. I ordered a pizza and I ate half. I thought you didn't like I'm pizza. A piece of pizza. I might be eating two pieces. That's okay. I think. Cold pizza is my favorite. I've never actually had this what pizza before. It smells mm. great. Looks freaking delicious. I thought we didn't like pizza. What happened? You know what? I get it though. She see, she is such a nice person. She's only doing this because she's trying to do some charity work. There's starving kids out there and I'm gonna let this pizza over here go to waste. I'm gonna eat this disgusting, terrible looking pizza. It just looks... It's so disgusting, but I'm gonna eat this for the starving kids in the Titanic. Yeah, let me just eat this pizza. This ugh, Oh my god, the things that I do for charity. I was gonna get like a side salad. Uh huh. So I can get full off of that. Yeah. They don't have salads there. They don't have salads? The only healthy thing was the roasted fried chicken. Wings, yeah. And that's what I was looking forward to, but they didn't have them. This is so sad. Look at her suffering. You think that they have maybe vegetables? They do. No, they don't. They have green beans, I think, but they're oh. made in like butter and everything else. Yeah, that's just so fatty. We can't do that. Let's order fried chicken instead. So she went to a fast food place and uh, she wanted to order a salad and they didn't have any salad. Now bitch, you know damn well that the only thing that they always have at fast food places is the salads because no one is ordering them shits. You could have told us a bullshit story that the girl who was making the salads today didn't come to work because she found out she had herpes. We somehow would believe that instead of you telling us that they didn't have any salads. So instead I just ordered a 50 piece of fried chicken. Hi, how are you doing? Uh, so, uh, do you guys have any salads? This is your lucky day, ma'am, because uh, we just got our new salads and we're running a promotion where we're actually giving them for free. How many do you want? Like five, ten? They cost nothing. They're free. Oh my god, really? Anyways, can I do a 900 piece chicken nuggets? Oh, you look so cute. Oh, this is her girlfriend? Make it a little bit bigger. I don't know. Baby, you just gotta lose a little bit of weight. I know you can do it. 572.4 pounds. 572.4. Oh! Ah! Did you break the scale? The audacity of her telling her girlfriend that she needs to lose some weight. This girl does not know that mirrors exist. How are you gonna tell your girlfriend that she needs to lose weight when you just broke the fucking scale? 2.4. Oh! Ah! You're the missing sister of the 1,000 pound sisters. I don't understand why she lies about ordering healthy when in fact she's not ordering anything healthy. Like we can tell from your weight that you're overeating a lot. You don't need to lie to us in front of a camera that Oh, I ordered a veggie sandwich but they didn't give me a veggie sandwich. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, please hit like, subscribe with the bell icon and consider becoming a member. Members get to watch my videos a day early. And remember kids, eating a broccoli with your 3000 calorie fried food does not make it healthy. Eating a green or two in a while, I mean, yeah, it's good for you, but that's definitely not gonna help you lose weight when you're devouring 6,000 calories a day. So instead of blaming yourself, blame the fast food workers that they sent you two fries instead of one. <laughs> I know we've all gotten takeout food once in a while, right? Sometimes they give you a large Coke instead of a medium, some bullshit like that. But the Cheesecake Factory giving you a whole large fry for free? <laughs> you wish, they don't even do that shit for your birthday. Stay skinny guys, eat your apples with your burgers.